All right, it's been a while since I last played this. Uh, let's do Forgotten Fortress. So I, I haven't played Creeper World 4 in a time just because I had other games that I wanted to play. I was kind of busy and holy shit, this looks messy. Uh, hmm, Forgotten Fortress. Okay, uh, but they recently announced that there is going to be multiplayer for Creeper World 4. And I am all about that. So uh, I'm going to start playing some solo maps, some randomly generated maps, and just kind of here and there again. Um, until at least some other series, you know, pop in and say like, hey, uh, you should devote time to us, and then I'll switch over to those. So I'm thinking this area. We're going to have to isolate, uh, either cut off these sections or somehow manage to get some cannons on the other, other side to hold it. This is spooky. Two every second. 20 every half second. 30. 30. Is this just two? So that's a really slow emitter. An annoyance, for sure, but not a big one. Let's see, is Flood the World still a strat? I, we'll find out. Okay, I uh, gotta remember everything here. What is the button to go into top-down mode? No, C centers the map. I mean, Z zooms me out like crazy, but that's not really what I'm looking for. Um, it's not caps lock. Okay, I think the music might just be a smidge loud. It's It's been a while. I think I reformatted my computer between uh, sessions of playing this. Or since I last played this. Okay, let's just check controls. Top-down camera is F9. Uh, we can do better than that. What is tab? Tab is copy build. I don't use copy build anyway. Okay. And now, as per usual, the grid. Okay, now, I think we're, we're still paused, yeah? Cool. So, I think normally what I would do is head for those resources, but I think what I'm going to want to do instead... is head out here. We want to see if I can specifically knock that down before too much happens. Oh. Oh, they're just slightly down. That's why it looks like heck, but that's fine. Okay, how do we how do we unpause? What is spacebar used for? I have no idea. Space. Space is cancel. Oh. Pause is shift. That makes sense. I, I can work with that. I just have to remember what the, uh, what everything exactly is. All right. So we're building up. We're fine. That's piddling out pretty slow. Yeah, so we want to hold these choke points. Because if we can take them, the rest of this map is... Well, maybe not the rest of this map, but the rest of this little island is ours. And that's a great deal of safety. Oh. Here's a problem. Is it? Okay, that's that's properly gridding. So while we're here, weapon... I'm just gonna get, like, one or two basic cannons down. This thing is gonna just need to be... smacked around, but not feared. But yeah, let's just fly this in. I should be able to just turn it off almost immediately. Okay, I'm... Oh. No. Oh, how dare. Okay. What is the... What is the button? It is not... Delete. Destroy. Ah, it's Control-X. Or... 
It's it it is a button somewhere ra approximately around Control X. It's either Control X or Shift X. I just I I am literally playing this on muscle memory right now, and that is not the worst place to be, honestly. I've done this before. It is okay. Reminds me of the one time I I don't remember who I was on uh, on a call with. But effectively, somebody had asked me, like, Hey, Wonder, what's your phone number? And I could not remember it for the life of me. So I just pulled up my touchpad and said, uh, you know, just started typing. And even though I had no recollection of what my phone number was, uh, the, the sheer muscle memory of it was enough to just make me remember off the top of my head. Okay, so things that we're going to need, we're going to need a factory sooner than later. Can I fit it up here? The answer is big no. I guess I'll fit it back here. Okay. Main reason being, we're going to need to be able to shoot, shoot some missiles out of the sky. Sooner than later, I'm not actually sure when they're showing up. But it's something I'm going to have to contend with. Music just, like, totally pieced out on me. Alright, it's fine. Okay, how are we looking? Got two minutes. Okay, so we're probably going to want a pylon here. There we go. Still using a fair amount of juice. But I think th I think this is going to be one of the simpler maps. I don't I don't see anything to do with like their towers ramping up, so I think I'll be okay. Just going to put that one there. Uh, let's see what else do we have? We have the grid. No matter what goes wrong, we will always have the grid. I feel like I'm some kind of weird Tron cultist. Oh right. That was literally the joke that I made the last time this came up. I was like, I, I knew the whole Tron cults thing was going to return. Okay. Ah, uh, you know what? We might as well just have... Nope, that did... Not even that works. That's good enough. Yeah, I'm just trying to cover as, as much immediate landmass as I can. Back to Creeper World 4? Yeah, why not? I I wanted something else to, to do tonight while we waited for Shell. And Creeper World felt like a great option. Uh, let's see. No, let's cancel that. We want to get some mortars. And some missile launchers. Oh. We also have inconvenient eggs. I forgot about the eggs. To be honest with you. Alright. One way or another, I think we're good. Is it just me or is this map, like, kind of easy? This might actually be one of the easy easier ones available. Oh, the big issue is this has just overflowed. Okay, right. I should probably go to this and get a nullifier, just so I'm not wasting. Okay. Power is good. Got plenty of blue. The one thing is, I haven't seen any mining spots, so we might be kind of strapped for energy for much of this map. So that could be the... 
the immediate qualifier on whether or not this goes well. Is just staying relatively energy efficient while also maximizing the amount that I'm able to generate here. But here, here's the sneaky, easy solution. The grid. Always the grid. Okay, except for that section. That section uh, will have no grid. I'm not that I'm not actually that possessive of my whole grid business. It's just a fun thing to meme constantly. Okay, so now this is good. It doesn't look like we've got any others. I've got a couple of points here. I'm thinking we we fly this gun in. We're going to I'm going to see if I can get a couple of cannons. And maybe also an M rift. Okay. We need to have a pylon there. I guess my original placement was subpar. Don't kill it yet. Okay, you just go back. You go here. The rest of these guys should be able to handle this. That's not that deep yet. If I can... If I can set up a foothold there, I will be a happy camper. Okay, so far so good. Let's just get a regular tower here. A little faster to build. A little easier to work with. Oop, that was out of range. Okay, so MRIFs are these. I'll put it there. That should be reasonably easy to protect. Yeah, what else we got? Shit tons of stuff. I uh, I guess actually, easiest answer. Great squad, and you guys are always going to be on. I could probably utilize them out here. That would be the more sensible location. But, uh, since when do I do that? Okay, should probably also make an urn portal. And go back to collecting these. I don't think I'm gonna terp too hard on this map. It's been a while since I've terped anything. Hey, thank you, uh, BLT22 for the, uh, Prime sub. Thank you so much. Let's see, with those blue, uh, blue stones, would it be better to... Uh, actually use it? Yeah. I just forget about the sprayers sometimes. They're kind of weird. Not, not weird. Okay. Let's do energy collection and... We're not using mines. The fire range. Should get a third. There we go. I really missed, missed that map where you could s straight up make your own uh, urn. Like, I thought th I thought we were going to be using those factories constantly, but the answer was, nope, that pretty much just never happened in this game. You get it for, like, one, one map, and then it's just like, eh, actually, never mind. Okay. Well, you're right. Let's... Let's actually move these over here. Let's see if I can stem the tide here, because the biggest issue that I always run into when I play these games, this game, uh, is largely just that getting a, a solid foothold anywhere can be kind of tough. Oh. And so, by holding on to this, if I can, 
we keep a, a really good foothold on their whole base and can just use it for our own our own purposes. Here we go. Move some of these guys up. And get some towers here. Because these guys are going to get out of range real quick. Ooh, handy. There's a, actually more blue eye production there. We might want to just go kind of nuts with that. Yeah, let's do it. Seeing as they've given me keys to the kingdom as far as sprayers go, let's just... Let's spray. And since this area is locked off, uh, all of the all of the anti creep that I produce in this area is more or less going to go straight to the the war effort and not be squandered on anything else. I can't currently ah, I was still selecting one of those guys. That's what it is. All right, next order of business. What do we do? We've got eggs are a bit of a nuisance. I guess actually, let's go porter. Because we've got a couple of more locations that I could potentially yoink. Uh, mainly just to, to put put holes in them while I clear the rest of this area. Even like around here. Didn't work. Like, all it takes is one mortar on a hill and suddenly you, uh, suddenly you can do quite a lot with it. Iron want. Gun! Actually... That's not what I wanted to do. I probably should have actually given one of these mortars an urn. As long as it's going to make Wonder realize he doesn't have a portal at the hub. Potentially the whole... Uh, the whole mission. I don't know. Easy for me to forget, honestly. It has been some time. The nice part about this is, as long as I'm punching him, the anti-creep should be able to keep most of my backline solid. You earn none. And give it this. Because, yeah, if I can get to that sucker. This one's the one outputting the most, I think. Well, both of them are. But if I can get on top of these walls and actually hold it... That should work well enough for me. Okay, these good? Yes. Okay, so we are going to do... Nothing fancy. There's These areas just exist for me to output... Uh, mortar shells right in the middle of their base. Never mind, it immediately just... I feel like it did that on purpose. It probably didn't, but it always feels personal when they do that. There we go, look at that. To some degree, it would be nice to have, like, a regular cannon there. Uh, let's see. Let's actually just build a handful. Okay, select delivery pad, put in the center. This will be fine. Now, very real possibility this area is going to get missiled. Uh, I've kind of just accepted that. Just get those two there. And I should have one more of these guys that is currently not being utilized, correct? Yes. I'm just going to do that. 
It might get missiled, but my ambivalence is eternal. Okay. Spread the web. And keep expanding out. What is this guy doing? He's still lobbing him hard. Do you want to get slightly closer and get lobbing? Yeah. Might as well. Okay, what else do I have? I got you. I've got you. Okay, things we'd want to consider at this point. We're going to need some anti-eggs, anti and we're going to need some missiles. Okay. There. Now we should have a bunch of pylons together. I'm really lucky I can just start putting things up on top of these spots. Okay, that should get some juice. That again. Should be able to get it. Ah, it's the eggs that are potentially messing with me. You have an odd feeling you've seen this map before. That's possible. Let's move that over there. There we go. That there. It's weird. The music is... I was expecting it to be much more uh, aggressive, but it kind of just tuned out pretty quick. Okay, but this way, this little island will get connected. This this actually worked out really well. Normally with these maps, I'm always worried about everything being really, really slow. And today we're just kind of kicking it. Okay. Keep forgetting the pause and the cancel buttons are switched. As far as I'm concerned. Okay, sniper. Get a couple of those. Is this? Wow. They never ta targeted Battle Island over there. I was really expecting uh, one of these spore launcher shots would just... Okay, this is going to backfire on me in a really bad way, isn't it? I mean, to some degree, that actually was not nearly as bad as it could have been. I love Rage Snipers. They're like... They're... Very silly. For those of you not familiar with my playthroughs, I always like to just send a sniper out and give it an urn and just let it go nuts. And it almost always does. Like, the... They're just, like, the angriest creatures alive. Okay, so this thing is pretty much cowed. Oh, it's nullifier? Please tell me nullifier up there. No. Dang. Am I gonna have to have the nullifier? No. I can put the nullifier on this rock. Perfect. Taking this one out might be tough. Uh, let's see. I got a terp. Uh, let's see. We're good on anti-air. What happened? That was weird. The entirety of my setup just blinked off for a second. Well, I... Not gonna question it, I, I I guess. Let's 
move these guys out here. They're not doing me any good anymore. You missile. How's the anti-creep flow going? It's going a little bit steady. Wins the race. Oh, we got the recla reclaim charge. Not that that really helps. Eh, it's nice. Okay, so we want to go terraform. Let's see. Control C. Hey, you know what? Let's just bring that one up to 20. That'll give us a good spot to hit the spore launcher. Okay, so how's everything else doing? And this... This is pretty much skunked. Can I... It's like I can almost... I'm just going to put it there. Maybe I can't. Okay, do we just build another terp here? Yeah, I'll just, I'll just make another terp real quick. And, and extend slightly. There we go. Main reason being, I mean, honestly, why not? It's easy enough, and once I get this high ground, then both of these can be nullified safely without having to worry about backflow immediately taking out the nullifier. Let's see, which is usually usually the big issue that I have to deal with. Boy, I'm not fighting on all fronts here, though. Like these guys, 100%, can just advance. One thing I do run into whenever I play this game, I often find, like, a couple of fronts that I specifically focus on, and then everything else I just, like, it falls off. Because it's, it's not important to me. Eh, eh, maybe not that it's not important. It's not dangerous anymore, so it, it's not like I need to care nearly as hard. Okay, here's a question. Yes. I can just have a pylon up here. Okay, so next up, weapon. We're going to need a shield. Is that another special? It is. Because this keeps overflowing on top of it. Like, no matter what, spore launchers are just going to be wildly inconvenient. It right here. Hopefully that'll prevent the flow from really getting in. Looks like we're good. Pop a nullifier. Oh, you ants. Alright. I guess I'll just do that. Because as soon as I have that, like, fully nullified... Easy peasy. Go back to this. Get a tower down. Okay, there we go. That's done. This is still looking great. I do the same thing over here. Perfect. All that leaves is that one. Okay. Another pylon over here. Yeah, we'll just do it slow. And once you get control over the situation, you never really lose it. Not unless it's on purpose. There have been a couple of maps where things get dangerous, but yeah. It's almost kind of the complete opposite of balloons. Where, like, in balloons, you always start somewhat in control. Uh, at least if you know what you're doing, and you can, you can pretty much just take charge. Um... But things rapidly get out of hand, especially if you're not careful. 
Okay, let's move these guys here. Might as well flood this section. Oh. This got... Oh, it's probably because of the eggs. In retrospect... Yeah, that's just going to hit our nullifier. I'm going to pop those eggs before I do anything else. Okay, move them closer. Move them closer. Move you closer. Yeah, we got this. Alright, everything else good. And yeah, now, th now that that especially has been... Knock down a peg. Oh, those are going to go off. Oh, but that means I should be able to nullify this now, finally. How are we doing? Decent? Uh, let's see. Might as well... Plop a mortar up here. Actually, my rage mortar. This feels like a good spot for a rage mortar. You can still lose if you stretch out a thin, unsupported power line, especially if you're speeding through a level. True, but I'm usually I'm usually too slow and methodical for that. I rarely make that specific mistake. My my whole grid meme. Oh shoot. My whole grid meme is partly as a reminder to to keep the uh, keep the network strong. Okay, move these guys closer. And seeing as these things are like super cheap anyway, it's I don't know. It's easy to just spam them all over. I'm, re I'm really looking forward to potentially playing this multiplayer with Orbital. I feel like that's just going to result in some wild nonsense. Might be able to get some other people to join me on that one too, but... I think it, at the very least it's going to be the two of us. Maybe we'll reach out to, like, a vac or something. I feel like he might be interested. Alright. And weapon and nullifier. Level done. Easy peasy. We've got everything else? No, I'm missing a totem. Right. There it is. Good to go. Yeah, having these little forward operating bases that were effectively... They were never going to be particularly... Oh God, what would I say? If I lost them, it was not going to hurt me. And so I had everything to gain by putting them down. One, two, three, four, no trouble at all. Well, that sounds fun. Four pieces. Guess we'll do that next.